Welcome everyone. Today I am in North Carolina in the twin towns of Kill Devil Hills and Kitty Hawk. And among these spider webs, something magical happened. You ever say to yourself, where was the Wright Brothers area where they flew the first plane? Over that way. Come on, join me. This way. Come on. Wait, I'm tangled up. Come on. This way. Come on, join me. Join me, come on. This way. I'm tangled, we're tangled here. We're tangled. You wanna take a ride back to the past? That's right, brothers. It happened right over here. Come on, I'm gonna show you where all the magic happened with the Wright brothers, come on. Let's pick up the pace. Let's pick up, look. Shh. quiet. There it is. Panoramic shot! Here's some interesting reading material that you can't find on Google. Or maybe you can. A monument to the impossible. And check this out. You may have never seen this. This is what the plane looked like that they used. Wait, get your shadow out of there. Back it up, back it up. This right here was the plane. Get, come back in. The shadow actually kind of looked cool. No, back out. Back up, just back over this way a little bit. That's good. That's the plane right there. That's the plane. And this probably wasn't here back then. I'm not talking about the water fountain. Come closer. I'm not talking about the water fountain not being here. But check out that little cactus right there. That's a cactus. That's a cactus. That's a cactus. That's a cactus. That's a cactus right there. It's a cactus. The closer I get from your perspective, I get shorter and the monument gets bigger. It's crazy how that thing works. It's science or maybe it's not science, it's physics. Those are two things the Wright brothers had firmly grasped in hand, because they invented a plane. The only thing I've invented is nothing. This is pretty fantastic, look at this. It's carved into the door, this guy here. It's upside down. I'm not supposed to be standing here. From this moment right here, I'm not even kidding you, right here, down that hill is the path where they first created the plane, or what was gonna be the plane or a glider that was kind of like a plane, but not really a plane, that turned into a plane. The evolution of planes. Speaking of flying, check out over here, we have some birds. Birds fly. It's kind of a tie-in for my video. Those are crows. They fly. And ever since the Wright brothers started flying, people have been crowing about that for years. Check out this little guide railing down here. They would have pushed straight towards this way on what would have become the first flight. Straight that way, 120 feet. In fact, we have a rock here set up displaying in memory of the first successful flight of an airplane. Right here. 1903, history would have been made right down this railing. They would have gained speed using this as their guide. Straight ahead, picking up speed right here. History's about to be made for the first time. 120 foot flight, first ever. History is being made right here. Success.
This was the camp area that the Wright brothers built and used. A lot of the brainstorming and the creations happened right inside of here. It's pretty amazing. We got a little work desk area over here. Who knows what kind of plans and drawings were created right there in that area. And right outside here around the corner is where they would have parked the planes, what would have eventually become the planes. Their ideas all came to fruition right in here. And right over here, of course, is where the first, second, and third flight would have happened, underneath this sun. It's hard to believe and crazy to believe that right here in 1903, the Wright brothers stood under that same sun on the same stretch of area, and the flight happened straight that way. There's the markers, first, second, third, and of course the fourth flight way down there. That's progress right here in North Carolina. The Wright brothers. That's me right there in the window. And what's inside this window? Let's take a look right through here. Looks like some replicas from the planes right inside there. I'm on the back side now of the monument. The first flight would have happened way over there. This is the more secluded area. I have a question for you. What do you think this might be right here? Let's get a little closer. Come on, let's get a little closer. It's like some sort of mausoleum thing. If you can figure out what this is, leave a comment below. Let's start a little conversation on what this crazy weird secluded structure is on the back side of the Wright Brothers Memorial. Cactuses. There's another cactus. Cactus is on my feet. What are these guys so excited about? Well, I'm going to show you. Right over here is a replica of the flight. This guy's giving a round of applause here. He's clapping. This guy has a fancy camera here. And what's he taking a picture of? Right there. Check that out. Sunset in the background. You don't get much more beautiful than that. History right behind us, folks. Without these two guys right here, you might not be able to fly to your favorite destination, and NASA might not ever exist. Think about that one. Thanks, guys. Let's see if anyone's home. While we're waiting for someone to come to this door, hopefully, make sure you subscribe right up here. Also, I started a second channel, the Daily Woo channel. Check that one out on YouTube also. Thanks for watching, everyone. What is this place?